The X-44 Manta is shaking up aerial warfare. Unlike those roaring relics from yesteryear, this jet's engineered for hush, velocity, and evasion. It materializes and fades quicker than radar can spot it, rendering vintage fighters clunky and outdated. Amid escalating worldwide strains, powers are hustling to craft the pinnacle of airborne armaments. Yet, America surges forward, crafting aircraft so advanced they feel ripped from a blockbuster sci-fi flick. So, what sets the X-44 Manta apart? And why do China and Russia keep a watchful eye? Dive in with us as we unpack the groundbreaking tech powering the U.S. latest invisible jet and how it might redefine aerial battles ahead. Soaring without a tail might strike you as totally unreal, but U.S. aerospace titan Lockheed Martin once pictured just that. Their revolutionary vision, the X-44 Manta short for multi-axis no-tail aircraft, wasn't merely some standard combat jet blueprint. It stood for a full reimagining of how planes slice through the heavens, offering agility that turn even Falcons green with envy. A prime case is piloting a vehicle sans steering wheel, just by tweaking how the motor propels you ahead. The Manta pulled off a comparable game changer in flight tech. Experts at NASA, teamed with the U.S. Air Force, delved into this tailless marvel with real intent. Sure, it could enable airborne feats once seen as utterly out of reach. Steering its power across three axes, skyward, earthward, port, starboard, or blends of them. Sprung from the stellar F-22 Raptor, this no-tail stunner sported an extended delta wing akin to a colossal arrow tip slashing across the heavens. Its genuine edge lay in its omissions, those everyday vertical stabilizers gracing almost every jet out there. The aim was to pioneer cutting-edge flight tech, ditching the classic tail seen on most jets. These bold innovations promised sharper stealth and sky-high performance. NASA planned to test them on an F-22 Raptor, maybe even a vintage F-15. They targeted prototype test flights to kick off by 2007. NASA saw the X-44 Manta's tech as a game-changer, not only for warbirds like the F-22 or the upcoming F-35, but also for zippy civilian airliners. Back then, visionaries were dreaming big, imagining jets that could soar swifter, quieter, and with unmatched precision, outpacing anything before. The U.S. government and two private firms bankrolled the X-44 Manta's early stages. In June 1999, NASA gave the official nod, dubbing it the X-44 Amperes. Aviation buffs were thrilled this jet could usher in a bold new flight era. Yet, by 2000, budget cuts grounded the project before it ever soared. But those radical ideas never really disappeared. Future projects, like the planned FB-22 strike aircraft, drew on that same tailless vision. In truth, the spirit of the X-44 Manta still lives on echoing through the silent, lethal jets patrolling the skies today, and very likely shaping the drones and stealth fighters of tomorrow. When visionaries in aviation set their sights high, they aren't looking for small tweaks. They want to tear up the old playbook entirely 
The X-44 project papers demanded an aircraft that would leap ahead of cutting edge. Just as smartphones didn't simply upgrade flip phones, they redefined communication itself. Lockheed Martin's bold mission was clear and deeply transformative. Show the world that a jet could fly smoothly using nothing but engine thrust for steering, tossing aside centuries of old flight traditions. The X-44 Manta, stripped of vertical tails and stabilizers, would blend in with the skies, far tougher to detect on radar without those usual reflective surfaces. Picture how a flat pebble glides farther across a pond compared to a rough one. That same idea was built into the Manta, only this time with radar waves. By stripping away the usual tail fins and stabilizers, it became harder to track, more aerodynamic, and fuel smart. And at its core, the X-44 still carried the muscle of the F-22 Raptor engines and frame alike. But the Manta pushed this foundation even further, with a bold delta wing shaped like a forward-pointing triangle and no tail at all. This extreme design offered big advantages. The oversized triangular wing allowed it to hold more fuel than the F-22, giving it the reach to stay on station longer or punch deeper into hostile territory. By blending the control and thrust systems into a single streamlined design, Lockheed Martin set out to craft a jet with fewer parts that could fail, improved fuel efficiency to push its range, and breathtaking agility that made older fighters seem frozen in slow motion. Picture a boxer slipping punches while barely shifting at all. That was the level of efficiency and responsiveness the X-44 Manta was built to deliver in modern air combat. Its reputation grew so strong that Lockheed Martin rolled out another design carrying the same name, the X-44A. This little-known relative was an unmanned aerial vehicle test platform crafted in secrecy by Lockheed Martin's iconic Skunk Works division. Unlike conventional airplanes, a UAV takes to the skies without pilots, crew, or passengers inside. These advanced machines are directed remotely or set to fly on their own, marking a major leap in aviation technology. An unmanned aerial vehicle, also known as an unmanned aircraft system, or simply a drone, is essentially a flying platform that operates entirely without people on board. Rather than seating a pilot in the cockpit, these aircraft are directed remotely from the ground or fly independently by following preset instructions. During the 1900s, armed forces across the globe began building drones, designed for tasks that were too dull, hazardous, or outright risky for human aviators to handle. Picture spending endless hours circling over a barren desert, only to watch for the slightest suspicious movement. That kind of monotonous task is exactly where a drone shines. By the start of the 21st century, militaries around the world saw drones as indispensable, using them to collect intel and execute missions without endangering troops. And as control systems became smarter and production costs dropped, the role of UAVs quickly expanded far beyond strictly military operations. Today, drones are used in countless civilian roles, from shooting stunning aerial footage that once demanded costly helicopter flights to surveying massive farms, giving growers precise data to manage their crops. At the same time, the Advanced Tactical Fighter Program set its sights on building a jet that could massively outclass anything that had come before.
This next-generation jet was designed with cutting-edge tech, advanced computer systems, stronger engines, and unique materials that made it almost vanish from sight. By 1986, the U.S. Air Force had narrowed the competition to two giants, Lockheed and Northrop, tasked with creating prototype aircraft. Both companies built prototype jets, the YF-22 and YF-23, to prove their visions in the air. These demonstrators first flew in 1990, showcasing the future of air combat. After months of rigorous trials and evaluations, the Air Force made its choice in 1991, selecting Lockheed's design to move forward. Through a phase known as engineering and manufacturing development, the experimental concept would be transformed into an operational aircraft that could be produced in quantity and deployed in real missions. Lockheed's victorious concept eventually became what we recognize today as the F-22 Raptor. This jet rose to the top as the U.S. Air Force's premier fighter, blending advanced stealth that makes it nearly invisible on radar with blistering speed and unmatched agility. That mix gave American pilots a decisive edge in combat, allowing them to spot enemy aircraft long before their opponents even knew they were there. Beyond its main testing objectives, the X-44 Amperes also played a role in supporting other key programs. In one fascinating experiment, the drone showed how unmanned aircraft could potentially function aboard U.S. Navy carriers. Putting these abilities to the test with a drone marked a major leap forward. Those carrier trials laid the foundation for the carrier-based drones we see today. What makes the tale of the X-44 Amperes so compelling is that Lockheed Martin built this groundbreaking aircraft entirely behind closed doors. Defense firms often handle classified projects, but concealing an entire aircraft program for nearly 20 years is nothing short of extraordinary. It's powered by a Williams F-112 turbofan engine essentially a scaled-down version of what drives commercial jets. But the real surprise is its size. With a wingspan of only 30 feet, roughly the length of a school bus, it measures just half the width of its bigger cousin, the RQ-170 Sentinel. This smaller frame made the X-44A easier to move around, and harder for radar to pick up critical traits for any combat aircraft. And with just one tank of fuel, the X-44A could remain airborne for nearly an hour and a half straight. Although this flight time seems brief compared to modern drones that can stay aloft for days, it provided sufficient opportunity to experiment with new tech and collect critical data without a pilot aboard. Today, aviation fans and history lovers can finally view this once-classified aircraft up close. The X-44A now rests at its permanent home, the National Museum of the United States Air Force, located near Dayton, Ohio, giving the public a rare glimpse into a top-secret piece of aviation history. Housed in the Research and Development Gallery of Building 4, this enigmatic drone was unveiled to the public in October 2020. After being kept out of sight for decades, visitors can now witness a key chapter of aviation history. Meanwhile, both China and Russia are closely monitoring the United States' X-44 aircraft concept, recognizing its potential impact on future aerial warfare. The jet is also large and heavy. While this allows it to carry a huge arsenal, the extra weight reduces its speed and agility, leaving it less maneuverable than other fighters in close-range dogfights.
the major military powers Russia, the United States, and China are locked in a competition they rarely talk about publicly. Each new fighter jet, missile test, or space mission is part of this silent race. While they claim to be just upgrading equipment, their actions reveal a deeper rivalry. When America unveils advanced aircraft like the X-44 Manta, China and Russia rush to develop comparable models. It's a high-stakes game of catch-up that drives military technology around the globe. Thanks for watching. See you there.